ladies and gentlemen. Get ready for three rounds of action in the bantamweight division. Fighting out of the red corner, she's wearing the red trunks, weighing in at 107 pounds. She trains at Five Points Academy with one win, zero losses from Brooklyn, New York. Alma Vicencio. And fighting out of the blue corner, she's wearing the black trunks with the gold trim and weighing it at 106 pounds. She trains with Chalk Sabai. Undefeated record as well with two wins, zero losses. From right here in Manhattan, Om Pino Pusarek. in the changing rooms, are there any questions from the red corner? Any questions from the blue? Okay, touch gloves, let's come out fighting. We turn our attention to the ladies here on Friday Night Fights, brought to you by Mohegan Sun Resort and Casino. First of a scheduled three rounds between Om Pino Pusararek in the black and yellow, taking on Alma Vincencio in the black and red, and immediately Om on the attack. They are not wasting any time. <laughs> There's no feeling it out. Ohm's somewhat of a fan favorite because of her diminutive size, but her aggressive nature in the ring. Native of Bangkok, Thailand, now calls New York home as she trains under one of the best in the business, Natalie Foos, over at Chak Sabai in Midtown. Asensio, meanwhile, representing the famed Five Points Academy in Lower Manhattan. Two women locked up here. Early stages of round number one, this amateur affair. Shin pads being, in, being used, as you can see. Pino Pusarek, is la her last time out, defeated Mai Din by unanimous decision as Ohm takes a right hand down the middle from Vicencio. Ariel Agami ringside with Jason Strout, the head coach. Out of Church Street Boxing Gym, not too far from where we are right now, the Broad Street Ballroom in Lower Manhattan. To a non-stop from that opening bell. A lot of action between Vicencio and Pino Pusarek. We come down the stretch in round number one, under 30 seconds left here. It's fairly rarely you come to these fights and see an overmatched fight. The matchmaker here does a great job making sure there's an even bout. This is a flyweight battle, 110 pound weight division. There's a two lock up once again near the blue corner. Both ladies trying to land knees from the clinch, under 10 seconds to go. Nice. And Vicencio able to kind of wrangle Ohm and take her to the canvas as the bell sounds in round number one. Lots of action in that first round. It's the nice thing about the lighterweight fighters, they just do not stop. As we check in on the corner of Om Pino Pusarek, you see blood coming from the nostrils. Natalie Foos taking a look at her fighter. So a little bit of an early stagger for Om. Her full name is Propaporn Pino Pusarek. We will go by Om. Probably for the best. I don't want to butcher her name unnecessarily. Young lady, as we said, hails from Bangkok, the Muay Thai capital of the world. Her opponent, Alma Vincencio, calls Brooklyn home now, though originally from the state of California. Got her instructions from Steve Mills before round two begins, and now here we go, Vicencia out of the red corner, back into the center of the ring against Om Pino Pusare. Both of these ladies have great trainers in their corners. They've been around the sport of Muay Thai for a long time and also did a lot for the sport of Muay Thai in New York. Vicencio in the red and black trunks where they at stands at five foot five. Pino Pusare is at five two. Again, Vicencio trying to muscle Ohm towards the corner. This time she does, able to stick a knee in as well. 
There's the Sarah Moy blast in the background here at Broad Street Ballroom. Pino Fusarek and Vicencio sizing each other up. And again, Vicencio able to overtake the smaller Pino Fusarek. Combination down the middle by Pino Pusarek. She lands another right hand. Yeah, almost got a good right hand there. Stuck in another right hook. It was a little bit of a grazing blow. Now Vicencio trying to reestablish control from the clinch. Vicencio gets a hold of her and starts working those knees. It's... That has been where Vicencio's done most of her damage thus far in this fight. We come down the stretch in round two. And she keeps going back to it and it's working. Right hand from Vicencio, but then she takes one right back from Pino Pusarek and another right hand from Ohm. Vicencio stuck in a straight right as well. Under five seconds left in round number two, and there's the belt. Getting off the ground is very exhausting, especially as the fight goes on. Pulling herself up off the canvas can take a lot out of you. What do you think going into round three, Jason? Is this anybody's fight right now? Both ladies have done some pretty good work in there. I think Vicencio's got control of this fight. Holmes landed a couple good solid right hands, but I think Vicencio's tied her up enough and won more of the round. I think it's Vicencio's fight. But by no means is she blowing her away. It's still a close fight. Taking a look at Vicencio getting instructions from Arjan Steve Mills. And there's Om Pino Pusarek, still with the bloody nose. Getting some ferocious instructions from Natalie Foos. So Chak Sabai versus Five Points Academy, two of the best schools in New York, two of the best Muay Thai training centers in America. Going head to head right here. This is round three. Ari Lagami ringside with Jason Strout, the head coach at the Church Street Boxing Gym in Lower Manhattan. We come to you from the Broad Street Ballroom in the Financial District to begin our 20th season of Friday Night Fights, fi Friday Night Fights, I should say, Muay Thai, which is brought to you this year by Mohegan Sun Resort and Casino. Both girls looking for an opening here. Big right hand, and then a left by Vicencio. Good combination. Way to put her hands and legs together. Vicencio, the longer fighter, able to stick another right hand in there. Now maybe trying to establish some distance with the teeth. Pino Pusarek stops Vicencio in her tracks for just a moment. But another good combo by the California kid who now calls New York home, that being Alma Vicencio. Oh, big right hand from Ohm Pino Pusarek, maybe one of her best punches of the fight. Good leg kick by Vicencio. Final half minute of round three of a scheduled three. Definitely using all the aspects of Muay Thai, the clinch, kicks, the punches. Blocking. These two ladies are, are definitely taught very well. Under 10 seconds now, round three. Looks like we are poised to go the distance. Pino Pusarek locked up with Vicencio. In the center of the ring, and there is the bell. Jamie Crowder, our referee, will break him up. And a hard-fought battle between two game amateur fighters. Prapaporn, Om Pino Pusarek, and Alma Vicencio, who you see right there. Steve Mills, seemingly happy with the effort of his fighter. I think he should be. I think she got the nod on this one. Definitely pulled off the fight. Stayed busier in the clinch. Used her distance well. Put the hands and kicks together. A 
await the official decision. Meanwhile, Pino Pusare looking to improve to 3-0 as an amateur. Vicencio looking to improve to 2-0. So somebody's O has got to go right now. Who will get the nod from the judges? Shout out to our sponsors, Mohegan Sun Resort and Casino, Lucky Strike, Budweiser, the Brooklyn Athletic Club, Fairtex, the Tourism Authority of Thailand, Fitness NYC, the Scratch DJ Academy as well. Looks like we are ready to go here. The judges have passed in their scorecards. For the official particulars, we will send it up to Connor Hall. All right, ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we do have a winner by majority decision. The judges see this 28-29 for the red corner. They see this 29-28 for the blue corner. And the deciding judge sees this 29-28 in favor of Om Pino Pusarek! Well, Om Pino Pusarek, the fan favorite here at the Broad Street Ballroom, comes away with a hard-fought majority decision. Jason Stratt, your reaction? Yeah, she pulled it off. I, uh, maybe. I don't know what I was looking at tonight. It was a good fight. I think it was very evenly matched. Maybe she was landing the harder blows. Um, I don't know. I, I thought Vicencio was taking a tour in the clinch and beating her on the outside, but maybe I was watching more of as a, more as a fan and not so much as a judge. So Om Pino Pusarek is your winner by majority decision here on Friday Night Fights Muay Thai, brought to you by Mohegan Sun Resort and Casino.